Hello, welcome back to Blogging with Mark. Right now I'm sitting here in our church, in our prayer corner, anticipating what's going to be coming up in the next 24 hours. Along with my wife, my two boys, and many members of our church, we're going to be traveling from here to Palmul, Mexico. That is there on the Yucatan Peninsula, where we're going to be working with Doug and Darla Miller. They do their ministry primarily in two places, in Palmul, which is their hometown, working with people from Mexico, as well as travelers from outside of Mexico, including the states and European countries. But their primary ministry is in Chen Chen, a Mayan village within driving distance of their home, where they have been working for many years. Approximately 10, 11 years ago, Bonnie Kay and I went to that village where the work was very young. And I remember sitting in a home of one of the Mayan people, uh, being translated twice, English to Spanish, Spanish to Mayan, and talking about Jesus in the scriptures. Now, all these years later, as many other churches across the low 48 have joined with Miller's in addition to ours, the gospel has been spread more and more among those people. We're gonna to get to go back now, bringing many with us. We're gonna be doing ministry there, working with the women and men and children and teenagers. We're going to be working through the language barrier, but through translation. We also won't need to be translated as we're playing volleyball and soccer and those kind of things with them, doing some spa things, some construction things, uh, viewing their gospel wall that tells the entire story of scripture through painting. Look forward to seeing that and just really encouraging the people to know that people very far away from them love them and care for them. So I encourage you to be a part of this trip. You hear me talk about the fact that we go serve through three primary ways. We can go, we can give, and we can pray. And I want to talk to you right now about praying. One of the best things you can do for us as we're gone is to pray. And we're going to be giving information about, about who to pray for and some specifics to pray. But we encourage you to pray for our team and pray for the Millers and pray for the Mexican and Mayan people who really need to experience the love of Christ in a great way. I encourage you to do that. When we get back, we'll tell stories and report how things went. I trust God that things are going to go very well. And I thank you for your part in helping us go uh, through, through praying and through giving. Appreciate your time watching this and look forward to seeing you back. I'll bring stories from Mexico.